What's up? Hey. Hey, come on in. Come on in. Sit down. There's no glue on it this time. There's no glue on the chair. There's nothing on the chair this time, guys. Ah. <sighs> I'm standing, thanks. All right. Oh, shit. Yeah, you can do that. I mean that's fine. It's a little weird, but it's fine. You can you can stand if you want. You're being too nice. No, 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 no. Now everything's fine. Streamer, why aren't you mad, guys? I mean, actually, today's actually an exercise. Today's an exercise. I'm, I'm going to remain zen. I, I'm doing this thing where I'm going to stay zen. I'm actually not going to get... I'm not going to get agitated the way that a lot of people think I'll... I'll fine, I'll sit. Big mistake, dude. The chair explodes. Your butt gets blown off. I don't know why you thought that was going to be a good idea. That's not very calm or zen. I don't own these chairs. I don't own the chairs. Hang on, this is like, there we go. I fixed it. I don't own the chairs. All right, I actually didn't even install the chairs. The chairs come with the building. All right. I don't know where they come from either. Uh, why is there a based mods tag? Why is there a based mods tag? Get that out of here! What the fuck? Mods, the only people you have to blame for this one is yourselves and the snitch. You told me to switch it from power tripping, and I did not say to switch it to based. I never said to switch it to based. Am I not based? Anyone who claims to be based is not based. Sorry. Fine. Then you're not wholesome anymore. Power tripping mods are so fucking back. Bring them back. If that was the response to that, bring back power power tripping mods immediately. God damn, they're so back. Guys, I'm just like all of you, chat. All right, I I'm getting I, the. They're, they're bringing me down too, okay? Mod me? Maybe one day. He's so relatable. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. Fuck yes, dude. Updated it for you, boss. Hang on, let me take a look. Hang on, let me take a look at this. Let me, let me check it. Let me check in the code here. Painfully unfunny streamer. Okay, okay, okay. At least people know. At least, at, at least people know, you know? It's out there, we all get it. No, Ugh, guys. This is one of those streamer get angry games. I, I don't, usually uh, do these. I don't usually do these uh, because um wait hang on yeah because uh, because um I just don't really like hurting myself. I, I never did the jump king game I never did uh, I did I did getting over it because um well it uh, ended up being something I did with Cheat Engine to like corrupt it and had some fun with that like years ago. But I'll tell you what. I did have fun with that Knight's Try game. And this one's kind of just, um, that peaks of your game. So, I might actually be good at this one. Hang on, guys. Like, here's the thing. Hear me out. 
I might actually be good at this one. This one might be the one that I'm just naturally talented at. This could be it. What's the speed run time for this game? I don't know, but I'm about to set it. I don't know, man, but I think I'm about to set it. All right. I think I'm about to set, getting over it was like a minute or something. Yeah, but guys, all right. All right, here's the thing. Think about it like this. Uh, think about it like this. If you open up a speedrun for getting over it, what you actually see is someone wildly flailing. And before the speedrun that they posted online, they wildly flailed for about 500,000 hours. Uh, so there's a chance that I wildly flail the right way and win in one or two tries, statistically. Yeah, but they're flailing really well. The, the look. Statistically, there's a chance I do a perfect run of this game on my first try. And when that happens, world record is apparently 10 minutes, 31 seconds. I could get adjacent to that. Guys, I, I can get adjacent to that. Incredibly loud, incorrect buzzer. Who turned that on? Someone stop that guy from doing that. Take that out of their hands. Turn that off. I mean, guys, uh, let's not forget that um, no one can prove that I was using Cheat Engine when I achieved a sub one second world record in getting over it on stream. Technically, no one can prove that. Anything that that is said to the contrary of that, including from me, was AI. Just to be clear, it was AI. Add it to the allegations, but that's all it ever will be is an allegation because you cannot prove that ever. Okay. Hire an astrophysicist to prove you didn't cheat. Maybe I need to. The same reason why Dream should still have the Minecraft world records. We can all agree. We can all find common ground here. If you hire someone with a doctorate, you should be absolved of almost all wrongdoing. Yeah. Is a paid professor like a paid chatter? Kind of, yes. And we should still respect and accept the words of a paid chatter just like we do a paid professor. For if you are not paid for your fucking job, you are a clown. Okay, you're a clown. So... The professor would have to be paid, or they would be a doofus, which would prove that they don't deserve their degree. But clowns get paid. Yes. I suppose we should reconsider this then. You are below even the lowly clown. If you are not paid for your work. Even the clown receives money for their 
Play, bro. But tomato, you're a clown. This guy doesn't know I get paid for this. This guy doesn't know I get a page. That makes me super relatable, actually. Wait a minute. That makes me really relatable. Hang on. The clown is honorable. A modern samurai. I don't. I don't know about that. I know several real clowns, and they are fine, upstanding taxpayers. I feel like clowning should be a tax-exempt profession. And when I become president, I will make it so. It simply is like, it's like a, it's just one of those things where I don't believe clowning as a job should be able to appear on any tax documentation as a real profession. It should be untraceable income. The slept on clown demographic. Guys. Think about it. It's like, let's not even get into the fact that if the IRS ever tried to audit a clown, they're going to have like, what's the clown going to fucking do? They're going to be walking into a big old line of freaking pies thrown in their face. Balloons. Honking. Can I see your paperwork, sir? Clown starts pulling out a really long ribbon. Dude, it's like... I just don't see how you do it. Comically large book of paper. I don't know. It's like... What about mimes? Are those clown adjacent? What about mimes? What about mimes? Alright, those guys are gonna be sp like s spooking me and making me feel uncomfortable right on the side of the road. You better damn well hope that at least if they're gonna be standing on that sidewalk, they better be paying for that fucking sidewalk like the rest of us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do not play around. Mimes are taking clown jobs and they're doing half the work. They're not even making funny sounds, they're doing half the work. Mimes are constantly protected by a box. Whenever the IRS shows up, the mimes just do that wall, that invisible wall trick, and the IRS has to respect it and back off. Mimes are proto-clowns. I just don't like them, guys. Does anyone- Alright, show of hands. Show of hands. Who actually prefers mimes over clowns? Because my logic is, even in the worst of cases, a clown announces its presence. A clown announces its fucking presence and makes its little fucking honking sound. Okay. A mime could be standing behind you right now.
A mime could be standing behind you right now in the room. They could be under the floorboards. They could be in the walls. A clown, even if it was in the walls, would still make, God, I hope this is the right sound still, in the wall. You would, they would be obligated by code to do this, even if they were in the wall. And then you'd be like, what's that? And then you'd be able to react to it. But a mime, I mean, all you might hear is faint scratching sometimes, like a, like a mouse. Okay, that sucks. We don't like that. We don't like that, guys, as far as I'm concerned. A mime wouldn't kill me, a clown would. I feel like the likelihood of a mime or a clown killing you is about equal. No, it's not. Well, here, no, think about it like this, though. M clowns have an equal chance of helping you. Like, for instance, say you... Say you fall into the toilet. And you yell, help, help! And then you hear the fucking plywood, like the drywall in your house, break open. And the clown starts honking as he runs towards you to save your life. He was hiding in the wall the whole time. Uh, he runs up to you, he grabs, he self-reports himself. He, he, he self-reports himself as a hero. Uh, he jumps out of the wall. He was waiting there the whole time to get you, but now he's here to help you. He pulls you out of the, he does like a funny little clown flip, and then he pulls you out of the toilet. Your life is saved. You call the police, uh, they throw a big net on him, and they pull him away to put him down. Uh, counterpoint. You yell, help, help, I fell into my toilet. Boom, something smashes through the wall. You can't tell what it is. It didn't make a honking sound. It didn't make any sound. Help, help. Something runs into the fucking room. It's a mime. And it just starts doing mime stuff. It doesn't help you. And then you get flushed down the toilet. Because no one helped you out. Because the mime couldn't actually help you. Mime didn't do anything. Mime revealed itself and then didn't do anything. It didn't help. It didn't hurt. But it didn't help. It pantomimes calling 911. Yeah, it, it doesn't actually dial the numbers. The clown would dial the numbers. It might, like, say some silly stuff on the phone with the officer, but it did dial the number. It throws you an imaginary rope. This is exactly what I'm saying. Someone in history has died because a mime committed to their craft too hard in a time of like like disaster all right that's real like i'm not i'm not making that up like it must have happened there is a mime out there who has blood on their hands through inaction but could the same be said for a clown a clown is just a silly guy with some extra, like, like, clothing and, like, some makeup on. All right? Silly guys save people all the time. They throw aside... They, 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 can, they, they throw aside the goofs to save lives. All the time. Clowns can be doctors <laughs> to meet them. They can. But a mime cannot be a doctor. I'm sorry. A mime cannot be a doctor. Yeah. No multi-classing for mimes. Yeah. Mimes are stuck in one lane forever. Do we all understand now? Do we all understand where I'm coming from? Mimes are hot, clowns are not. What the fuck are you talking about? 
What the fuck are you talking about? I'm not saying clowns are hot, but I'm definitely not saying mimes are hot. Dude, I mean, I'm also just gonna be honest. Um, I don't wanna, I don't wanna fucking, I don't wanna, I don't wanna like, like just make any assumptions. But does anyone else find it fucking weird that mimes are always wearing fucking prison outfits? From like the 1900s? Old timey prisoner garb? Questioning. Uh, a little bit of a, a little bit of an interesting question here. Uh, what did they do? Why do they have the black tear? Which implies they done did a kill. Four kills? <laughs> Four lives! Now I'm starting to think that ain't a rope that they're freaking pantomiming right now. It's a fucking Tommy gun. Hold up. Hold up. Think about it, chat. All right, just use your head and think about it. Because when I look at every single mime, many of them have those have those sad little tears or something adjacent to it. Think about it. Think how many mimes are in chat. Again, think how many mimes are everywhere. Like, guys, that's the thing. Think about all the mimes you see. And then think about all the mimes you don't see. You can only see them. You can't hear them. Squeak me harder. Thanks for the 10 gifted subs. Thank you. What has your neighborhood mime colony been up to? Hmm. Thoughts on Ronald McDonald. Um. Honestly, good for him. Uh, good for him. He, he rose to the highest peak that a clown could, I would argue. Um, he's a corporate clown. He's a suit. Guys, look, just like the jesters of old were like the best option you could be was to like, ha like be the jester of a king and a king's court. The, honestly, the best option a clown has right now for, like, publicity that's, like, positive publicity is to be a corporate mascot. It's the, it's the adjacent thing to being the court jester is the corporate mascot. And there can only be one because if anyone else in the industry of food ever added another clown as their mascot, McDonald's would gun them down. <laughs> so there's only one top clown. Jack in the box. Not the same as a clown. If I look up Jack from Jack in the box, he's not going to look like a normal clown, is he? He's going to look like a fucking monster. More specifically, like an ice cream cone. Can you tell the difference between a clown and an ice cream cone? Chat. Because yes, while they are still a business-oriented character who has objectively sold out to the, to the high life, to the good life, um, that is not a fucking clown. That is a man with a ice cream cone on his head. That is a snowman at best. That is not a clown. If you think that's a clown, you're a fool. Sorry. That is 100% clown adjacent. You think that thing is clown adjacent. You're gonna tell me, okay. Hang on. I'm gonna pull up some images for visual aid. Now, I'm gonna pull up an image here of two different characters, okay? And you're gonna tell me which one is more adjacent to, uh, to this, this, this suit. One of them 
is going to be Ronald McDonald. For, for the sake of just, like, consistency here. Okay, so... Here's a picture of Ronald McDonald. Actually, guys, I am not going to load up this specific picture of Ronald McDonald because I have no idea what the caption for this image that saved is. Uh, the image, you know, I am going to load it up, but I have no idea. This is from the, wait, what website? Whatever it is, it's an image of Ronald McDonald. Uh, I'm not even gonna get more into that because we're gonna get distracted. We're gonna get distracted. That's a whole new rabbit hole. Something about war. Uh, something- <laughs> something about war. But that's an image of Ronald McDonald. That's a clown. Okay. And here on the other side, what I believe was closer, is Frosty the fucking snowman. Now- 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 I'm gonna tell you that it's Frosty that this guy is more adjacent to than fucking, uh, like an actual clown. Uh, clown experts can feel free to weigh in, but I'm gonna tell you it's probably it's probably gonna be Frosty. I see three clowns. I banned that guy. Frosty is borderline clown, actually. Dude, I was never a very big fan of Frosty, the snowman. What the fuck? Why? Well, one, he kind of sucked. Two, it was kind of scary. Like, I'm gonna be honest, guys. If I put a hat on someone's head, on like a fucking, like, snowman's head, and it come alive and start singing, I'm gonna start crying if I was a kid. I would not like that. I would not be very pleased with that happening to me suddenly like without heads up like him just starts he just starts doing that i would be genuinely terrified um also frosty like the the main theme that people associate with frosty is impending mortality all right that's all i'm saying like unlike rudolph where it's like oh he's a little different and like he finds a way to uh like you know like, fit in anyways, and people- he finds his own use in the world. The only fucking, uh, like, thing that I ever think about when I think about Frosty is that he was born to melt and die in about two months. Maybe a couple of days, depending on how the weather goes. Aren't we all? Yeah, but I don't want that- I don't want that lesson taught to me by a singing fucking snowman! I don't want that lesson taught to me by him. Dude, let my parents teach me that. Not this traumatizing fucking living snowman piece of shit. Holy crap. Rudolph is a horrible lesson. Explain. 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 Better be good. The other reindeer are only nice to him after they deem him useful. Guys. Listen. We can't cover every single issue with society in a single stop-motion movie, okay? <laughs> we can't cover- Listen, you want people to like you, do something that's helpful to them, that's life, okay? I got a newsflash for you, if you never do anything helpful, most people are gonna be like, I don't really like that guy, he doesn't do anything. If you sit around, at my place of work, and all you do is spin around on the office chair, I'm gonna say, I don't really like that guy. But if that guy steps up at the next fucking, like, meeting, and does some crazy shit to make my job ten times easier, yeah, I'm gonna be nicer to him. Matter of fact, I might even like him.
I learned the right lesson. You're just evil. <laughs> no, guys. No, guys. Tomato, <laughs> Tomato has that 1880s circus owner mentality. What the fuck? Whatever, man. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> PT Barnum ass. Guys, get off my case! Alright? Still saying that's a better fucking lesson to learn than freaking Frosty singing about. Singing about how he's gonna fucking die in a couple of days, dude. Jesus Christ. I don't need my snowman to teach me that. Frosty appreciates the time he has. Do you guys think that the reason Frosty comes alive when that hat is put on a snowman is because someone fucking died wearing that hat and possessed it? That's a ghost. Oh, it's cursed. Yep. And he's gotta be cursed, right? His soul is stored in the hat canonically. I just, guys, here's a fucking issue that, like, I feel like if I was frosty. That I would clock immediately upon coming alive. And it would be... Oh my god, if this hat comes off of my head, I die. If this hat comes off my head, I die. If this hat comes off my head, I die! And then I'd probably, um... Start freaking out. Dude, imagine having a hat on your head, and if your hat comes off, you die. I do, it's called a scalp. Yeah, but a scalp doesn't casually, like, blow off in the wind unless you have some kind of horrible condition. Maybe yours doesn't. What the fuck is up with some of you? Get yourself some hat glue. Yeah, but guys, you're also made out of snow, so it's not like you can, like, tape shit to the snow. That's the problem, guys. That's the problem with Frosty. You can't tape anything to it. You can't glue it. It's snow. Dude. I don't know if I could I don't know how uh look all I'm saying is that if I was frosty, that movie would have been a lot darker a lot faster. Alright, because I would not have so gracefully accepted my impending demise, having died once before and inhabited the like hat that I was wearing. Those kids would have walked away a lot more miserable after their snowman started screaming and yelling at everyone to get away from his head because if the hat comes off, he dies. <laughs> Alright, because that's how it would have played out. That kid who put that hat on the snowman's head, boom, get the fuck away from me! Boom, get the fuck away from me! Get away from me! <laughs> run to the woods. Then run to the woods. And considering, uh, Live in Canada, it's really cold. Yeah, I'd run in the woods and then run north as fast as possible, assuming that I don't have lungs and can't get tired. You'd be a terrible snowman. Guys, 
here's one thing they don't really cover in those kinds of things. It's like, imagine if your body was now in a snowman. You don't have, like, the flexibility of, like, like, like you've got no bones anymore. The feel, imagine the feeling of having no bones. Like, your body continues to work, but you have no bones. You're lucky if you have three parts for a body. Some kids cheap out and they only do one big part and then a head. I've seen kids in my neighborhood growing up get bored after making one ball and the snowman is one big ball with a hat. Why does the magical force animating his body only work on snow and hot wa and not water? Um, I don't know, man. Do you think the kids would get really self-conscious if I became like, if I was like a frosty like entity and I became alive after they put the hat on Frosty's head and then I said, "You really can't do better than this. Make a new one. Make a new one. I'm gonna watch and then you move the hat over to that one. Make a better one." And then I get like really upset about it and I say like, "Go get some clothes for it." I want a, I want better stick hands than this. All right, I'll help you find them, but we're getting better ones for this one. Make me better. Jeez. That's how it played out in Animal Crossing. Guys, again, I never played. Uh, I played Animal Crossing for the window of about March to April, because the second that Easter came around and Zipper, the monster rabbit showed up, that's when I stopped playing. I, I didn't play anymore after that. I didn't, I didn't dare. I was done. I have better things to do. I'm a zipper apologist. Not sure why you'd not sure not sure why you'd want to be one of those. Apologist, what the fuck did he do? Uh, he fucked with the loot tables of every fucking thing in uh, Animal Crossing and ruined the game for like a month. The bastard. He put everything in eggs. So is the frosty hat kind of like a soul gem from like Elder Scrolls? Like it, what if it's not like a ghost that inhabited the hat? What if it is that a dark necromancer uses the gem, uses the hat kind of like a storage receptacle? If I make a frosty the snowman and I also am invested in enchanting uh, objects for like reselling and it comes alive as Frosty the Snowman, and I clock that that hat has a valuable soul in it. I'm pulling that hat back off his fucking head, and I'm turning it into a sword that does 5 to 10 fire damage on hit. That's all I'm saying. Yoink! That's going right on into this sword, dude. Come on, it would be cold damage. Nah, dude. Nah, dude, you get to choose that kind of stuff. That's not predetermined. One and two. Okay, <clears throat> everyone knows fire damage is way better than cold damage. Give me a fucking break. Give me a fucking break. Come on. Shut up, nerd. No. This nerd still loves Charizard. I don't give a single shit about Pokemon. 
I do not care about any of them but Nosepass. Thank you for understanding. I like the one that smells with their nose. The nose pass. What about its evolution probo pass? Trying too hard. Sorry. Trying too hard. I'm confused. Is he talking about pals? <clears throat> no, I'm not. No. Tomato, I need your thoughts on the incredible news I sh shared with you yesterday. What, that they're making an animated Twilight? I'm not sure why they would try to iterate on what's already perfection. This is like the reverse of like... Like, why the hell would you make an animated version of something that I would argue is already perfect? The, the movie adaptation of Twilight was the, like, trashiest bullshit ever, and the idea of trying to make anything different out of it is such a goddamn waste of time, and I'm not sure why they'd bother. Show the clip of the fire, baby. Look it up yourself. Better yet, watch all the Twilight movies in their extended version. <laughs> In a row. But Tomato, they would animate the fire baby. Yeah, but do you really... Guys, here's the thing. Do you really believe that the animators won't, like, shy away from some of those, like, sillier things from the movie because they may not exactly have been how, the, how it could be interpreted from the book? This is the problem. This is the problem. They may not even spike the baby into the fire in the animation. This is the problem. And if the baby doesn't get thrown into the fire, I just don't care. Destroy the child. Guys, we're gonna have to go, we're gonna have to go inside the video game soon. I think we're gonna have to we're gonna have to start climbing soon, guys. Not even an hour in. I don't think he can do it in 10 minutes. Uh, all right. Okay. Is this gonna be a Gamba stream? Guys, I have seen the darkest of Twitch chat in every single time I've done a Gamba stream. Every single time. It's almost constant. You guys like devolve into like wild animals. And I, I'm so tired of it. You get so mad about it. So mad. Tomato friendly reminder. That, no, that means it's not friendly. Every single time someone says it's a friendly reminder, it is absolutely malicious in nature. Daylight savings is Sunday. Okay, yep, yeah, there it is. Fuck you. Thanks for nothing. I bet we're losing an hour, too. 
I bet I bet the clocks go forward. Fun. I'll have to go to sleep an hour earlier to play on uh freaking hell divers or whatever at noon on Sunday with the boys. I'll have to go to sleep even earlier. Fun. I love changing all the clocks in my house. Guys, you guys don't have like... I'm lucky. This house I'm in now, all the clocks that are like digital automatically recognize daylight savings and just uh, fix themselves. I, I haven't had to change a clock in a little bit. They know. I live in Arizona, so I don't deal with daylight savings. Yeah, but you deal with 111 degrees in the summer. For like two weeks straight. Yeah, but you get owned. Hundred eleven plus about ten degrees. You mean how high is it getting over there in Arizona, the worst place on earth? Try living in Scotland, because Scotland is at hundred and eleven degrees. What is this point you're trying to make? Ah, uh, yes. Famously hot Scotland. Scorched landscape. Scotland, some call it. Ah, uh, yes. Try living in Sweden where we get about three hours of sunlight during the winter. Honestly, guys, I could live with that. I could handle that. I could make it. I could make that work for me. I prefer doing almost everything at night, including like running and going on walks. Aside from mosquitoes, uh, those bugs will get you at night, but aside from that, everything's better. Cold temperatures call to me as well. You need the sun, though. Tell that to my skin. Tell that to my skin that burns the second the sun touches it every day. Because I'm pale by nature. Yep. All right, guys, I'm gonna go to the bathroom and then we're gonna climb. And then after that, depending on my progress and how well I'm doing, maybe we'll pumping simulate. Maybe we'll, maybe after that we'll pump. Depends on, if you know, if I beat this game in, uh, if I beat this game in like fucking 10 minutes, you know what I mean? All right, we're back.
it's time. It's time to climb, guys. It's time to climb. Okay. I've played Peaks of Yore. Alright, we got our... Okay. We do have swimming options in this. So I'm going to go. And we will climb up this part here. Nope. Actually can't. Okay, we're gonna... Hang on. Can I go under the water? No. We're gonna check- we're gonna scope out both sides of the map so we know exactly what to expect out here. I already fucked up the speedrun. We're gonna restart by the time that uh, I get back over here. We're just gonna- we gotta do some, like, research. Scope out the tech. See if there's any moves we can do. Any, like, special tricks. Speed does not matter. You can get kind of under the water if you move the mouse the right way. There is officially no way to go, but... Uh, up. I'm gonna new game it because I- wait a minute. We need the highest graphics possible so I actually know what the hell I'm looking at at any given point in time. And let's new game. We're going up! There's actually no speedrun counter, so someone's gonna just have to keep track with their brain. I remember the first time I played Getting Over It. Uh, the equivalent of doing this was getting over that first little rock and slab of steel. And I'll tell you what, literally couldn't do it. So, so far, this is going a lot better for me. And I... Hey. Oh. I probably killed the last fucking 80 or 90 people that went up this mountain. Should probably keep that labeled for future climbers. You get a kind. Of, you kind of have this. Hang on. I assumed this green was bad. I'm just gonna give it. A, I'm gonna give this a quick little. Whoop. Yeah, you slide, guys. You slide on that stuff. The green slime is bad. This. We can grab the rubber. Can I? If I jostle my body enough times on this, do I just kind of? Do I just eventually let go of it? Okay. If you put too much force on the downward, your character will lose his grip. I kind of like that. You can kind of, you kind of force yourself down it. Hang on, I'm gonna try some tech. If I hold spacebar, my guy pulls himself up really quickly. Hang on. Hang on. If you hold spacebar, your guy pulls up really quickly without having to use the mouse to do it. <laughs> and so the streamer discovered tech immediately. Yep. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Hang on. Let me just. Is that like a shortcut way? Hang on. Let me just. <laughs> I can get this. Wait a minute. Guys. This is totally the right way. This is absolutely a shortcut path for gamers. You got me. Hang on, let me one second. Guys, if we learn this right away, we shave off like a hundred minutes off the time. So let me just. Oh! Oh! Get back over there. We're not done. We're not done. What's the highest point I can get? It's right here. What if I just pull myself up like this? <laughs> I don't know. Guys, this might be the first issue for me. I can get kind of fucking close. Though. If I... If I had the right level of... If I just timed it perfectly. I just, ha I just have to time it perfectly. Guys. A lot of people are going to say that it's not possible. But I believe it is. The allegations are winning. No, they ain't. Check this out. No, they're fucking not. As soon as I get the right... As soon as I get the right verticality on this thing, it's gonna be a piece of cake. No. No. Okay, maybe we... While we get used to the controls, maybe we go the right way. Because I don't think this is the right way. 
Maybe we'll follow it as we should. He's choking. We're warming up. We're warming up. Okay? Guys. Wait a minute. If you do that, if you... If you get really high up there, you can almost fucking get it. I just... <laughs> Some of you are... Oh, fuck! Okay, your guy eventually loses his grip when you grab it that close, but that was the proof of concept! Which means... I can totally do it again. Check this out. Guys, I can do it again. You just have to get perfectly on the very top with this hand. Without losing too much grip. Like that. And then... Oh, come on. Hang on, let me try it again. I think I can hold it. I, if I hold my mouse button, and I use momentum like that, we can get it. Hang on. Tomato, for fuck's sake, enable real monkey within. Come on. Yeah, I can, guys. I can do this. I have ancient primordial chimp DNA within me. It's been slumbering. And now... I'm about to activate it. Oh! Yep. Fuck! My guy lost his grip that time. On his own. Oh! Okay, there- This is the tech. We shave off a hundred hours. That path over there, it's 50 minutes to the video game. This path is the one that gets you there instantaneously, as long as you- What? Fuck. Oh! God, fuck. God damn, dude, it's the harder part's actually grabbing it and then holding on, pulling yourself back up. What? That part's tricky. Why not stand? Leg don't work. Leg don't work. They don't actually, uh... They haven't actually conveyed why that is, but le leg don't work. Grab it. What? Yeah. Fuck. What? If I go gently, I don't have to reset. Ah! Damn! Yep. I think it has to, it has to be, it has to be righty. It has to be righty, guys. Yep. Boom, dude! Boom, dude! Fuck that path, dude! Yep. We're going this way right away! Shave off 50 minutes off the clock. Let's fucking roll. Yep. The hell even are we? Creatures of the abyss died on this fucking rock. Skull. Oh my god. Uh, I think I have to go over to that. <clears throat> you guys want to see the gamer pop off? No matter, we climb again. No matter. All of it is merely smart minor setbacks in the grand scheme of the climb. Minor setbacks indeed. Behold, with my new, pr with my new Training. Look at that, dude! I don't need to do that whole way anymore, dude! We skip that part of the map! Fuck that shit! We just do the shortcut every time. <laughs> Boom! You get it once, you get it a thousand fucking times. Now, here we go. Let's try this again. I'm gonna get a little bit closer. This time I'm gonna do a different technique. I'm close, guys. I'm fucking close. I'm fucking close, all right? I've done a lot of practice climbing, not so much flinging. All right, just one more thing to get used to. Just one more thing, but look at how fast we get back up to the top. People out here are taking 15 fucking minutes getting back to that jump to use it. And me? 
15 fucking seconds. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. Hang on. I gotta get a better, gotta get a better hold on the, on the top there. There we go. Hey! Hey! I'm in. Well, well, well. It's the skull again. Chat. Let's get this one for real this time. <laughs> Hang on. Hang on, guys. My streamer peaked years ago, like Left for Dead. What the fuck does that even mean? I mean, I know what it means, but why do you think that's applicable here? Like, Left for Dead? Look at how fast I'm climbing. Look at how much faster I'm climbing as I go. You fucking have no idea what you're talking about, and it shows. Guys, I mean consistently getting the fucking shortcut every time. Think about it. Consistently. He's climbing up like a fucking monkey, man. I am going to fucking get this jump done. I'm gonna get it done right. I have to do more. I have to reach up higher. What if we get a warm up in on that kind of stuff by using the actual path the game intended for me? You know what I mean? What if we do it that way? Look at how fucking fast I go though, guys. Come on. Come on. What if we go this way just to like casually check out the other intended path? Get some practice slinging. Maybe that's the issue, is that we're doing too many swings and it's flipping my character's body around. That might be the problem. This is nothing to me. Here's a cake. I'm just doing this so everyone understands that I've completed all content properly. I mean, I obviously already did the shortcut for this, so none of this, none of this matters, obviously. Wow, this is a big fucking detour too, Jesus. I shaved a lot, I'm shaving a lot of time off by doing it the way I was trying to do it, guys. That's all I'm saying, guys, I shaved like hours off. <laughs> This ain't gonna fall. Going back to my shortcut, dude. This sucks. I'm going back to my shortcut, dude. I had enough of that shit. Yeah, right. I don't fucking do that part of the game, guys. That's for losers that don't know how to do all the high-tier tech. If you see anyone not doing this jump, they're a loser. All right, they're a loser. They're never gonna get to the top of the speedrun leaderboard. He. That said, no one is expected to do it perfectly on their first attempt. He. 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 Simple as that. Let's fucking go. I will achieve the impossible. Please! 
I touched it that time, dude. My fingers touched the fucking stone. I felt it with my fucking hands. The mountain spoke to me. And it said, stop, get away from me. It's hiding something. Man, this is so sad. LMAO, I just did the jump. I'm glad that my display here is inspiring people to climb and to overcome it. But if you're going to do the jump, you better have done the hard mode skip or uh, you're a clown. <laughs> oh! Some people just get really good at the tech, you know what I mean? I'm already back over here, guys. Like, it's fucking nothing. It's time. Oh! Oh! Reset. 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 Just reset it. But yeah. Oh no no. There we go. Nope. Come on. You gotta get your hand right at the top there. There you go. Get up that thing! You do not fall like this. All right, cool. Wait. 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 Okay, okay. It's been three hours. No, it's been about 12 minutes. Don't fucking lie. Guys. Maybe the issue is I need to be closer to here. Maybe... Because the issue seems to be that I'm not getting enough distance. Maybe if I'm a little bit closer to it, I won't need to do as much actual reaching. <laughs> ah! I'm getting- I'm actually devolving. I'm devolving. I'm getting less distance every time. Am I not swinging enough? Am I not swinging enough? I saw his cock. No, you fucking didn't. Am I not swinging enough? Guys, call the climbing committee. Is it because I'm not swinging enough? I fucking spit out some of my water because of that. Holy shit. Because you saw his schlong? He doesn't have a schlong. Guys, there's no cock underneath this. He doesn't have a big hog. Come on. Come on. Reset it. This is the trickiest part is just getting your hand in the right spot to actually do the trick. There we go. The second you get that, it's easy. Okay. Uh, climb now. I order it. Yeah. I said climb now. <laughs> it is as I command. Dude, I'm going back to my original technique. I'm gonna do a full body swing. Okay. I'm gonna do a full body, all strength swing. Wait! I, he let go on his own. He let go on his own. Fuck! I, have enough, I didn't have enough, good enough grip, I guess. I wasn't even looking at the screen yet! I was warming up my swinging muscles! Operator error. No, no, no. It was a problem with the rock. This place isn't labeled correctly. I just wish I could do this with, uh... 
the other hand. Okay. Come on. Get it. Get it. There it is. I've gotten consistent with that, though. That's not bad. If I get my hand in the right spot, I'm back up here in fucking 10 seconds. God, imagine having to do the whole fucking process of this before you get back here every time, dude. And thank God, this is gonna be the only jump you have to do like this in the whole game. No fucking way. No fucking way it's anything else. This is the only jump like this in the whole game. Dude, why does my guy's legs keep get getting in the way? It's his legs! It's his fucking legs! His toes! His legs keep getting in the fucking way, and then my hands are on the wrong fucking side! He's got an immensely high quality dive, though. Olympic quality dives. But he has the fucking, his legs, his fucking thighs are flopping around. If he's not gonna use them, we might as well, yeah, sure, we might as well cut him off. He doesn't use them anyways. He might as well cut them off, then they'd be out of the way. What if I just stopped doing so much prep and I instead just game hard, you know what I mean? Yes! Oh! Oh, oh, mother of God. Oh, mother of God. Give me. Oh, oh, oh. I lived, man. I lived. Let's get the fuck out. Peak! The peak! Guys, we've almost beaten the fucking game. We skipped about 90% of it doing this shit. Guys, I have a lot of practice doing those kinds of things at this point, dude. I got practice with that motion. That's one thing I have practiced. Let's fucking go. Oh, easy. Up here. Is that a new checkpoint? Wait, did I checkpoint that fast? Well, I guess I'm not there yet. Still have to get over to it. Ha! Wait. For anyone that's playing this or trying it, I highly recommend getting used to holding space bar for almost all points in climbing other than horizontal. Uh, it makes it a lot easier to do 90% of this shit. <sighs> a wonderful, beautiful oasis for me. A refreshing dip. I mean, I think I made pretty good time. Now, this is that kind of checkpoint that seems really safe, but is actually mostly going to get me thrown into the abyss. But for now, shall we? I see the path forward. If this is climbable. That's not, but there's this thing next to it that I think might be. There we go. Dude, I'm starting to get the hang of it, man. That's not climbable, that's foreground. Okay. <clears throat> Next up is that big stick. So if I try to grab before my hand is over the destination, the water is gonna push me down. Look at that, that's bad. Okay. Uh, how the fuck do I work around that? Nope. 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 That's not gonna be it. I might have to swing again. Or I can- No, I have to swing. But I can go for that bush instead. Yep, there it is. 
There it is. We're still in this, guys. Come on. We just have to climb the death falls. We trained for this. This is the exact kind of climb we trained for. I can almost get it. Come on. Come on. My mouse has to be on it perfectly. There it is. Let's go. Why the fuck was that not grabbable? There was a giant bush! What? Easy now. There it is. We didn't lose anything. We're okay. Look, considering my luck so far with the rest of this part, I ain't gonna complain about a little fall. That was just a little tumble. That was a little minor tumble. Compared to how bad it could have been, I'll take it. Dude, I bet I could actually do, like, some pretty big skips here. I bet I could skip that if I wanted to. Wait a minute. I bet I actually could skip this. Nah, I'm not gonna chance it. That's psycho. Oh! Oh! Boy, I feel like a million bucks right now, guys. Holy shit. After that one, I feel like a million bucks. That could have been a lot worse for me. Why, God? Why is my guy... So <laughs> What's up with all the slipping? By him? That's not good enough. Right there. There we go. This tires out your hand quickly, dude. This isn't like, uh, since you have to hold down the buttons the whole time while you're doing it and move the mouse like a ton, if it wasn't for the spacebar climb, I'd be, my hand would get tired after a little bit doing this. Controller, maybe? Maybe. But then you don't get the space bar climb, which is really nice. Do I wanna- I live, bitch. Okay, no more chance to get with the fucking waterfall. That place is deadly. That is not a joke, that area. I lived, though. I lived. He's so fucking cringe. No, I'm not! Ah! Ban that person for life. Ban them for life. I don't want to ever see them again. Change your fucking name, you want to come back in here. So far, I've only seen lost progress since I tuned in. Does it make you feel bad to know that you are, in fact, cursed and your mere presence is bringing me down? Because that's what you just described. Your mere fucking presence is a poison to me. Think about it. But check this out. Some tricks you never forget. Boom. I don't do that first part. I don't do that bullshit. <laughs> Back to zero, dude. Back to the old stomping grounds, bro. 
He never learned how to do the throw. He just got lucky one time. Guys, what I did the last time when I did it correctly right was that I didn't care. That was the trick. I didn't give a shit. I just... I just flung. Right? So maybe the trick is we just don't care. I need to be in the flow state. Yeah. At least I'm re- I, you know what, I'll be honest, okay? I'm gonna be pretty proud of that, that I can do that part so quickly, so consistently now. I'm happy about that. That saves me a boatload of time. Why? I didn't even release anything. My guy just- my- I put too much momentum into it on the first attempt. I have to like- dude, there's like a tech to it, man. You have to really take it easy on that swing or your guy just loses his grip. Fuck. That's really tricky. I would- I would say that's ten times harder than doing the shortcut. But golly, being able to see that this is like the maximum distance my character is capable of is a really convenient thing to understand as early as I've come to understand it. For the future, for the rest of the climb. It's nice to know that. Like, oh yeah, that's exactly how far my character could maximum do something. Ugh, this sucks. I don't even remember where I've been grabbing. I'm gonna keep on trying from this spot. Can someone call, um, like a, a person close to the spirits for aid? Can we contact the local shaman to, um, channel spirits to help me? Not 911. They won't be there. Contact the local shaman. They said no. There's no way you got a hold of them that quick. Grab it. So easy though. That part's so easy. Oh my god. So we're here again. I need to be a little bit higher up. Yes! Woo! Okay. About middle of that second rock is where I want to be. About middle. And then it's okay. Any lower, I don't get enough distance. Any higher, and I also don't get enough distance. This part still sucks, though. Easy. 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 I don't know what the fuck I did for this part, but uh, I'm worried it's gonna make me fling to do it, and I'm, I, I don't remember if I flung last time. There we go. No! <sighs> oh, to be back at my promised checkpoint, the checkpoint that I was promised. It was owed to me, that checkpoint. And now, I'm back at my old fucking shortcut bullshit again. Well, hey, at least this gives me a chance to practice this jump 18,000 more times while failing. So what, I was like right here that I did it right. Yeah, right here. <laughs> that one might have been my worst one yet. Hang on. Let me just try turning up my mouse sensitivity for a second. Because, to be honest, most of my climbing and precision shit is being done by spacebar. 
So maybe it'd benefit me to have some more sensitivity on the mouse for swinging. Guys, you need to understand what copium is. You're starting to do that thing where you don't, um... If I don't say it's the mouse sensitivity that's killing me, it's not copium. It's just me trying different things. You know, you're starting to not understand copium again. They don't know what copium is. <laughs> Whoa. No, don't like it. Can I go back to normal? Or what the closest was? Don't like it. Wanna go back. Come on. Come on. Gotta be a little higher up, I think. There we go. Come on. Give it to me. Give it to me! The exact sensitivity I was on was the only way I was able to do this extreme high skill trick. And now that I've lost the sensitivity required, I'm doomed. It's over, guys. He's gotta go the long way. Never mind. He's so back. Never mind, guys. Sorry. Sorry, haters. <laughs> You're back to getting fucking owned left and right. All right. Dude, grab it. Nope, grab it in the middle. Right there. Please! Oh my god, he is still on the jump. You miss- it, it sucks to be one of the fucking doofuses that left when I was thriving and comes back when I'm failing again. You missed the part where for a brief moment in time, I was flying like a majestic fucking eagle over this cliff. You missed it. You missed the part where I was climbing like a beautiful, beautiful Chimpanzee. All you see is what you want to see. I was on level fucking two, man. I was on the checkpoint. I made it in. I was climbing a waterfall. Dude. I think it's that I seize up. I'm seizing. Does anyone know, like, these, like, when you're doing some kind of, like, tense precision thing and your whole arm fucking lurches? Or your whole body fucking clenches up? I'm clenching. <laughs> My whole body is clenching. And then instead of making the full motion I need to do with my arm to grab the thing, I clench and I don't move. I'm telling you guys, I have a medical condition. That's what the problem is. I have a medical condition. I've got bonitis, guys. My bones are all bad. Where most of you have normal bones, I have squeaky bones. They squeak. Sometimes, if I move the wrong way, it goes like this. Ouch. And it hurts. It hurts really bad. Whoop! Easy. I wonder if me doing that trick is going to actually hinder me in the long run. 
because while everyone else gets better at clearing the entire natural loop of the game, I've just gotten really good at one specific trick, and I'm getting no time to, like, familiarize myself with a lot of the other moves or things in the game. Because I went straight to, like, the fucking hardest course option possible. Really good. I am really good at it. I'm consistent. I think that's just an alt path, not a shortcut. Having gone the real way, it is a shortcut. <laughs> ah! That dude threw me off my game. You know what kind of punishment we have for people like that? Rhyme zone. You better pray to God, all right, that you don't throw me off a second time. It doesn't work. It's not about working, guys. It's about it's about suffering. <laughs> guys, make no mistake. None of the punishments I dole out are for ref reformation purposes. They're not made so people can reform and get better. Like, to be clear, they're, they're not made to teach people a lesson. It's punishment. If they happen to make you better at rhyming, though, at the same time, then mission accomplished, okay? Then you're welcome for helping you. But that was not the goal. Guys, I may go back to dual-wield swing tech. If it wasn't for my big, meaty thighs, I would have it. I have to cut them off. It's just the big meaty thighs. It's these meaty fucking thighs, man. These gigantic hogs down here. You can tell. You can tell. You know, people were saying that they could see up the loincloth. If it's true that my guy has a gigantic schlong down there, if he's got a fucking third leg in that thing, it might be throwing off the weight. All right? It might actually be throwing off my fucking aerodynamic trajectory. So think about it. Think about it. Get the fuck up there. Come on. I'm actually not as... I'm not, my hand's not in the spot it needs to be. There we go. Oh. My God. I'm glad I invested in a gigantic mouse pad. That's like the size of the fucking desk, so I can actually, like, make these movements properly. Really glad I have a really big one. Because I'm, I'm, like, actively, constantly running out of space on my desk right now, even with that. Invest, so, like, 40 bucks. Any amount of money is an investment in anything, Chad. Just because it's just because it's a small amount of money in the grand scheme to invest, it's still an investment. Also, I would argue that if it was a forty dollar mouse pad, that would be a very big investment for a pad. It's a pretty big investment for a mouse pad. Can't up, get the fuck up there. Sorry, guys, I'm starting to get a little agitated by. My guys, um, in a, I think I, I think some of my fingers got annihilated during the uh, fall one of these last times. Sorry to startle some of you, but um, I think my dude's hands got destroyed at some point. Here comes the rage. Silence. Silence now.
Wait a minute. Hang on. I'm gonna try a new tech that might make this a little bit easier. I've been trying to move with spacebar and the mouse at the same time because I figured it would somehow make things easier. I'm just gonna keep my hand here. And see if I can get the momentum without doing that. So I can actually just preemptively grab. I feel like I could. My hand's not actually on the right spot is the thing. It's like really specific. The spot where you actually need to grab to do this right. Because my finger, my pointer finger needs to be a little bit above the tip of that rock to reach. That might be. There it is. It's like right there. No. Okay, you definitely, definitely have to do it manually. There's no uh, using the space bar to do this one. Just trying to get more consistent with it. I also am now realizing I can totally, f like, just tap space bar. It's like, get it a little bit easier. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Fuck! Uh, Unlucky, man. <laughs> It was luck that cost me that time. <laughs> That's what it was. Unlucky again, man. <laughs> it was luck. That's all it is. Bad RNG on the number generator, dude. Get me the fuck up this thing. I want- I deserve to be in pool number two! I shouldn't be down here! I shouldn't be down here! I deserve to oh, be higher! I deserve to be the best. I earned it. I trained harder than anyone else. I just don't know how to do the jump well. I just don't understand it, guys. I think that uh, might be the filter for me is a lack of fundamental physics understanding. I skipped that course, and I went straight to jumping really high, really quickly. I'm really good at my verticals, but I'm not so good at everything else. That's the problem with me. Yeah. Really good at the verticals, but everything else, I don't know. And by even really good, I mean kind of just barely passable is the problem. Fuck. I am gonna do it, dude. I'm gonna get it. This is all... It's all gearing me up for my big win. I did like using the one-body, like, swing method. But the problem was... Sometimes you just fucking don't get it. Sometimes your guy's legs just kill him. Okay, I'm going back to the swinging with my whole body because whenever I do the one hand version Sometimes my guy actually doesn't get any lift. I just can't do that one. I'm going back to swinging with both hands That is tis what I know Tis what I know Tis what I know. I mean, I know I did it correctly one time with the other technique, but I feel more confident with the two hand technique for some reason, despite it not working a single time yet. Tomato, please, you have to make progress off of Tutorial Rock. Can I have some support rather than people making demands? Okay, can I get, like, support? Would that be an option? Yep. Oh, oh my god! Yup, that's how we do it. Guys, when you swing with both hands, when you break the momentum limit where your character loses his grip, you just 
uh, you just absolutely slingshot. When you do that with one hand, your guy flops. Because there's too much weight. <laughs> there's too much weight spread out. That's the way. That's how we do it from now on. Oh! Okay. Last time this happened, it sucked so bad that it made me want to die. Easy, 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 easy. Need to be careful. I have to be really careful. Did I swing to do this? What the fuck was the tech for this? I don't remember how I did this. You did it. Yes, I did. I jumped. You just reached it. Oh, you mean something like this? Oh, fuck. There's no way I just reached it normally. There's no fucking way that happened. It's a fucking lie. There's no way I just... There's no way I just reached over and did it. With my bare hands? Like that? No way! My hand, my guy's hands are too stumpy for that, man! No way. Ain't no way. This is where I live. Nope. There's just no way. This is where I live. I live here. We can put a chair. We can carve a little hole out of the rock here and put a little chair in there. We put a little outcropping right there so I can sit down right there and rest my ass. We can collect nuts and acorns that fall from the trees above, right here. We can carve out another little room here and that, uh, we could rent that out to people on an Airbnb. Bottom feeder POV. I am not at the bottom. That would be the fish in the water. Okay. Yep. Ah! 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 <laughs> I did it and then I panicked. I actually did it. And then I was like, immediately my brain was like, don't leave. You have a home here! And I just released both hands and fell. Fuck. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. I finally have a technique for swinging. That works, dude. Holy shit, that took a while. I seethe? Why are you seething? Because I succeeded? Please! Dude. My character's grip does not like that part, but I can get to it way faster now. I'm get Once I get past that, the climb up to the next checkpoint's not horrible. It's bad, but it's easier than that part. We're getting there. We are getting there. We're getting better. I'm seeing differences now every climb. My tech is improving. And that makes people angry. It makes them defensive. They don't like seeing the gamer arise. There we go. Come on. I need to get a little higher on this. There we go. I don't know how to prevent my guy from falling when I do that grab, though. That's the one thing. Okay, so if I am truly getting a good technique, it will work the third time. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. That part's not the problem anymore. Yeah. 
Easy. 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 What is up with my guy's grip on this thing? Oh. God damn, that part's hard. I don't know how I got such a good grip on that, that one time. That part's tricky. Got it. Okay, you just have to do it almost like perfect timing on the uh, pull. And then you just suddenly get all, you're like elbows dislocate or something, man. Dude, I'm not gonna celebrate till I'm actually at the fucking pool, though I'm not dumb. There's no fucking way I'm going for it that fast. I ain't, I ain't gonna fucking lose my cool now. I gotta do baby steps. Whenever I do, like, the big ones, the chances of my guy fucking losing his grip go up. Just do baby climb. I'm like that. Then, up there. Nice. Up to that. Up here. One more. Across. Easy. Don't get greedy now. Easy, 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 easy. I remember this being the fucking problem as I went too fast on that part. Okay. The waterfall was what fucked me last time. No, I can almost see though. I'm over the water right now, so I'm gonna try this. I can almost see another, like, whoop. No, 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 no. Okay. Just wanted to see. God damn. Easy. This part's dangerous. If we lose our grip here, we fall out of the fucking checkpoint. I feel better once I'm here. Now I'm back over the pool. Fucking hell. I can't tell which one of my arms is holding anything at any given time. All right, guys, I'm gonna need everyone to pray. You're bad, kid. Hang on, who said that? Die, trash. That was the last message he sent me at before that. Chill, man. Chill. That's not very posy vibes of you. Dude, if I fell, that guy would have had the- that guy would have been receiving one of my famous reactionary temp bands. One of my world famous... Beloved reactionary temp bands, holy hell. Temp, quote. The temp! We only perma ban true morons around these parts, guys. Remember, if you have a permanent ban, that means you were you were identified as a true moron. Gotcha, dude. This is actually really bad. The issue I'm having right now is that I'm so used to holding grab in order to move. Like, to, like, grab something beneath my hands. But in this, it fucking kills you now. These wa This waterfall part will straight up kill you if you aren't precise. It'll pull you off of the fucking... It will straight up pull you off of what you're grabbing with your other hand. Precision climbing is required from here on out. Precision. Whew. Easy. 
This doesn't feel safe. You know what I mean? Oh. Oh. Is this safe, though? Last time I went over here, chat, I grabbed something. I tried to grab that big fucking plant. See that one over there? That's what I tried to grab, and it wasn't real. It looked grabbable, and I went for it, and it wasn't fucking real. So, uh... Yeah. Oh, really? Okay, hang on. Oh! 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 That's what I was hoping for. Please, 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 chill. Please fucking chill. Grab the rock. Grab the wood. Grab the wood with both your hands now. Death. Guys. I practiced this climb. This exact technique. We have training in this specific technique. This- Alright, that part doesn't have very good collision, but we're okay. We have training in that technique! Come on! We trained for that! God! Mother of God. Even the angels are looking down on me now. Beckoning me to heaven. And I have training in this. You think this game has jump scares like getting over it did? Because I was really worried when I touched that hand that I was about to get shot by a gun. I don't know what's safe and what isn't to grab here. I'm gonna guess the red bushes always are. Where the fuck am I? Oh yeah? All we gotta do is grab- Ah! 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 <laughs> <laughs> that was the checkpoint, man! God. Betrayed me. They beckoned me somewhere, but when I got to the top of their heaven, it was nothing but cogs and man-made lies. A deception. It won't keep me away from this, guys. Guys. I will get... Fallen Angel POV. Yeah, except, good news is, now we know that all of my practice actually paid off in a major fucking way, because they want you to do that fucking technique twice afterwards, and I already know how to do it. And I'm good at that move now. This part's the hardest part for me right now. This is this is actually objectively the hardest part in the game for me. Yeah. That's not good enough grip. Yeah, it's because it's because it's really hard to get the actual like grip with any depth. Cause you have- okay, I got it. So, chat, based on the angle of your body, that's what changes how your character pulls himself with spacebar. If I angle him as diagonally as possible, he pulls himself way harder in that specific direction. So basically, I'm kind of doing like a small micro jump by angling his body just right. That's dumb. That's dumb. Do this right. Don't cut any fucking corners. Easy. There we go. Okay. Checkpoint one. We are back. 
Checkpoint 2 doesn't make me feel great ever, I'll be honest. This one kind of immediately sends you off the checkpoint to this bullshit. Which fills me with dread. A great dread. But, uh... Nope, 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 nope. Good news is we are under, we are above the uh, pool right now, so. Huh. Easy now. Why am I struggling so much with this part? I remember this part giving me as much trouble. Oh shit. I pressed the wrong button for my hand. It did the opposite. <laughs> I get the weird feeling that's going to as fatigue sets in. The great fatigue of this game. I will find that happening a lot. Where my character just grabs the wrong thing or slips the wrong way. Oh! Easy. Yeah, still gotta be really careful. This waterfall will kill my guy if I grab it, if I like miss the rock. There we go. Alright. I wonder if the angle of my guy's hand has any impact on the uh, way he pulls himself up as well. It's wild that, uh... Oh yeah, I forgot about this fucking miserable shit. Oh my god. Well, at least we grabbed on. Uh, that part sucks, eggs. That part's- okay, so, the actual trick for that is I'm gonna wanna grab with both hands on that green, and, uh, hope that I break my speed enough that I can actually fucking grab on properly to the lower part, because I didn't break my speed enough with one hand. I have to do it both. Now we know! Every day, I get a little stronger. Easy. What a fucking psycho shortcut that is, dude. I mean, I guess you don't get as much danger of falling out of the map, but you can still fall out of it over there. And there it is. Ah, fuck. That waterfall's lethal, man. That part's the hardest part of the second zone for sure. For sure. No doubt. At least I'm like adept at the first part now. Like I know how to do it. I know, I know that it, none of it's like stuff that I'm confused how I made it to the other side anymore. We're getting there. The angels are weeping. Those ain't real angels. They were hiding behind a clockwork kingdom. All right? They were machines made by some psycho at the top of the peak to drive us cuckoo crazy. Think about it. They're not real. There's no god on the top of this peak. I can't deal with blaspheming tomato. You tell me angels hang out at about, like, 120 feet above sea level? That's where they live? That's where the angels... chill? Look at what you did! You screwed up my- You screwed up my jump. And you made me do an Olympic dive. Look at what you did. I screwed it up, you screwed it up. You distracted me by claiming that I'm a blasphemer when everyone knows that me and Jesus are super cool. We are very cool. Everyone, it's not a, it's not an unknown. Uh, it's not an unknown. All right, everyone knows it. I was rooting for him, but in the same breath, you claimed I was blaspheming. All right, 
So you might be rooting for me in game, but you're not rooting for my like relationship with God very much, are you? Kinda cringe. Ah! Devolving again. I spent too much time high up there where the oxygen is thinner. And as a result, I've forgotten how to do my jump. I've forgotten my jump tech. Close enough. There you go. Come on. Easy now. Come on. Come on. I will have this. It will be mine. This will be mine. It must be mine. God, I can't wait till someone finds out a tech for this game that just lets you slingshot yourself straight up like 20 feet in the air when you do everything perfectly. Instead of this shit. Where I need every single inch of my hand to do this right. Exhausting. There we go. Needed an extra swing there to make sure I did it right, but we got there. In the end. Now for the fucking awful part. Not as awful now that I know that I just need to kind of angle my character's body the right way, but boy is it still going to be a pain in the ass. Nope, that's not enough. I have to be really quick on retreating if it doesn't look like I have enough space. Is the issue. Gotta be really precise with this one. That's enough. Okay. You also have to- it, you have to just be so fucking gentle with it. This cliff requires respect from the climber. You have to respect the cliff. If you don't respect it, it'll throw you off back into the depths with the other failures. Like, it almost killed me right there for not respecting the climb enough. It almost fucking killed me again. What's happening? Let me up. Jesus Christ. Do not fuck with me. All right? I will I will blow this place up with goddamn dynamite. I will. I got a bag back in my base camp full of bombs. I will flatten this mountain. My respect only goes as long as they respect me back. The second they don't, Kablamo! <laughs> why did I do- why did I get so greedy with that? Oh well, we made it. Minecraft TNT grief. Look guys, you're either with me or you're against me. And so far, this mountain has shown nothing but the reality that it is seemingly against me. I don't play nice with people that are against me. Okay. Hell, I'm already, like, steps away from bleaching the source of this fucking waterfall when I get to the top. Okay? For what it did to me. For, for having the nerve to throw me off of it. Alright? It's about mutual respect from both parties. And so far, this game has failed to show any respect for me. Oh, oh, oh. Easy. Easy. 
This is the big one. This right here is the big one. Got it. Got it. Oh. We climbed. So am I sure this isn't grabbable? Oh yeah. All right, chat. So that part sucks. Jesus. Well, did live, but that part's brutal. Maybe I need to go to the lower part. I did it from the top one time and it worked, but uh, maybe I actually do need to do it from the lower part. Why? Okay, it's fine. We're in the water. We're still here. We are alive. We did not fall. Sorry, I'm getting really quiet at this part. This waterfall part makes me sweat in a way that is very difficult to convey unless you're doing it. I have like nothing to say, man. I can't talk when I'm doing that part. Dead air. Dude, that streamer wasn't talking for about 2.7 seconds, dude. Huge hell. I could hear him breathing, dude. I could hear his fucking breathing. It was weird. Why? If I just get the fucking bush, everything's fine. I just have to grab the bush. No, it isn't fine. How the fuck did I do that that one time? Can someone pull up a clip of me doing that right? Well, can someone grab that while I continue to climb this? I actually want to see what I did the last time for like visual aid because I did it out of sheer happenstance. Tool assisted streamer. It's my own past. What do you mean tool assisted? I'm not even looking at someone else doing it. I'm looking at me having done it. Fucking tool assisted piece of shit. Oh, gamer, gamer. There it is. Fuck that. We don't need it anymore. If you were taking that clip or grabbing it, shut the hell up. No one asked. Ah! I'm fine. I'm sorry I scared someone right there, probably. But I'm fine. Ah! Sorry. That's it. No more posy vibes. Guys, I got bad news. It looks like we're canceling posy vibes for the rest of the night. Oh my god, he's so fucking good at that part, though. I slap away the hand of God. Get away from me! You lied to me! You got me killed! Last time, I panicked here. 
This time. Oh! And just like that, baby, he is in checkpoint three. Oh, he's back. Two. Why do I get this bad feeling I'm gonna have to ride that fucking gear again? I hereby declare that zone two has been made trivial and now no longer means anything to me as of now. Oh, fuck off with this shit. Oh, fuck off with this shit. Who the hell designed this bullshit? What the fuck? This might be the end of our journey, guys. Hey, I mean, at least I got plenty of time to practice doing the biggest jump in the fucking game. <laughs> oh my god, what? I don't know, guys. They want me to do it a second time. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, they're gonna give me one more practice jump, and then I am doing a big one over the abyss yeah. again. Uh, which doesn't fill me with a lot of hope. Look, there ain't nothing wrong with surrendering. You know what I mean? At me if tomato falls to water. Who made that account? Who <laughs> made that account? <laughs> Who made that? Uh-uh. Oh, I don't, I don't feel so good, guys. Guys, I don't feel so good about the second one. I feel okay about the first one. Second one's making me feel like I'm not exactly... Like, I feel good about the first one. But I'm losing airtime. Don't act the... Don't do that! Even Katie's doing it. The amount of betrayal I'm experiencing on a fucking daily basis every day. Okay, there's no point in doing more than like one warm up rotation for the swing. Get away from the fucking head! Fucker almost killed me. Guys, don't at the- uh, They surely meant the bottom of the fucking pit. They surely meant the very bottom, right? They, they obviously meant the bottom. Uh, <laughs> Dude. That's actually commendable, the, um, the distance I got that time. I managed to eliminate all my kinetic force by breaking my elbows right there. <laughs> what is this fucking place? There's gotta be another shortcut I can use. That's like insanely difficult, but makes me look like an absolute badass. That isn't this shit. Please! Maybe I practice a one hand swing as well while I'm here. Maybe that's like better for this. Maybe I practice one handing. No! No! Dude, the boy's never gonna leave the pool. He's gonna be trapped in this water for a thousand years. He's gonna be trapped in the water. Some say he's been trapped there all along. Whoa! Dude, I mean, distance-wise, I'm getting some good swings. Eventually, I'll be the best. It's only a matter of time.
actually insane swing that time. Wait a minute. Hang on. We get a grip on this. Hang on. That uh, You can actually grab that part. Oh, that's way easier now. Wait, now it's time to die. Guys, look. It's time to fucking kill myself. It's time to throw myself into the cog and kill myself. Good. It's not as bad as it could be if it threw me all the way to the bottom, you know? I did land in the pond. I landed in the pond, and honestly, I was expecting a full exile. So, I mean, just the pond is pretty cool. I'll take the pond. Besides, I like this place. It's, um, it's scenic. You did, like, a lot of flips. Yeah, do I get, like, a rating? Guys, can we start rating my fucking falls? Is there, like, some kind of scoring we can do on that? I feel like I deserve some kind of score. Oh! Oh! Grab again. Go up. Grab it. Oh! 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 Got it. Oh! Yee! Piece of cake. Guys, look at how na- Have you guys seen how nasty my character's monkey hands are? When he's, like, in the reflection? The inner chimp is in full display in the reflection, the shadow and reflection of this beautiful, beautiful waterfall. His disgusting, nasty long arms. Okay, so I did this once by being a little bit silly, and I did it again by being actually careful. Got it? Easy. You know what? Get a better grip. Get a better grip. It seems like plants are insanely good grip. Like, you instantly... You have that forever. Uh, it's starting to seem like... I, I've never lost any, like, uh, leverage on one of the plants. So that's kind of nice. Some doofus struggles on that part every time, and then they get to this part and they start screaming the same way I screamed when I had to do the fling every time. They start screaming and frothing at the mouth and they say, I can't! Thank God that's not me. Thank God I did my time. What if I just hold on forever? Where the fuck am I supposed to go then? Where the fuck am I supposed to go then? Up? Just up. I was like... Crawl up the gear. That's... Impossible for me, guys. I I have no talent, guys. That is that is something that you expect to like pin upon like a great gamer. Not me. Not me. Not me. 
Tis not something you you declare to force me to do. Tis not me who does who does that. I do the silly guy jump. I do the silly guy jump where I go upside down while trying to do my jump. I don't. Tis not me you asked to do the big jump. You asked me to make. You you asked me to make the people laugh like a jester, and that's about it. Dude, get a fucking grip. Get a grip, man. Get a grip. Get a fucking grip and pull yourself together. Pull yourself together. My Mima just emailed me at this web zone uh, that I have here uh, at my at my specific web zone, and they said uh, they said they're watching now. So this one I'm doing for them. Guys, my Mima just sent me a freaking like dot dot dot. <laughs> yeah. What happened to me, guys? Guys, I think I know what's happening. I, the higher I get up in elevation, the more my blood gets pulled down to my legs. I'm getting weighed down by these fucking toes, man. I'm getting weighed down by these by these toes, these dogs. They're weighing me down. I gotta chop these fucking things off. What is happening to me? Dude. God, I wish I had legs that worked. Holy shit. <laughs> Please. 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 Oh, please. Once upon a time, I was one of the best at doing this part. Now, I'm washed. I literally can't do it. Easy, man. I was just waiting for the haters to fuck off. What is this bullshit? What is this bullshit? Guys, what is this bullshit? Because, like, that's got, I, I gotta not be the only one who got fooled by that. I gotta not be the only fucking streamer, the only absolute doofus streamer who got owned by that, guys. All right. You look to your left and right. Anyone streaming this game? 90% of them? Probably looked like just as much of a doofus as me when they got to this part. And they saw that last fucking pillar and they were like, it wants me to go that way and then climb up the gear. Nah, just you, boss. Nuh uh. Nuh uh. Not just me. What the fuck is happening? Help! Call the police! Someone call the police! Where the fuck do I go? Do I go down? Fuck no I don't, that's the abyss! Up. Whoa! Wait, 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 wait! Ooh! Damn. Now I learned this in frickin' 
You freaking metal egg zone of Sonic 2. All these spinning gears and things. Yep. All this stuff happened in Sonic. You know all these spinning gears and spinning circles. Oh, 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 oh fuck. No! No! Grab it! <laughs> Stop waving your hands around like a fucking moron and win the game already. Your Mima is watching. Fool. God damn. What the fuck is this shit? Sorry guys, I just have to output the commands for this part uh, at rapid fire. It's okay, I'm learning the tech. Oh! 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 <gasps> All my little toes are touching the ground now. All oh, my little toes, these dogs are touching the ground. It almost looks like I'm able to walk if I kind of go like this. Stop seeing dogs, please. <laughs> no, I don't think I will. Let me have some fun while I'm busy punishing myself for doing nothing wrong. Ah! Oh. Let them dogs breathe. They are breathing. They've been breathing the whole time. Why God? Why God? Why God? Why God? God. Do not exile me. I am your bravest warrior. I'm sorry that I let you down, but let me have the chance to try again. Amen. That time I just kind of seized up. My bones stopped working that time, was all. My problem is I'm trying to go too fast when I should just let the gears do the work. Tis their job. Bingo. Shoot up! No, go to that! To hold on! Hold on to that! Wait, wait, wait! Hold on to it, but don't! No! Oh. No, 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 no! Wait, wait, wait! Wait, wait! Jesus, that part's lethal. But we're okay. I could have been a lot worse. Easily returnable. Easily returnable. This is not the end. Easily returnable. Behold. Behold, my immense power as I return back to where I was. Behold my immense power as I do exactly as I claimed and get chewed up by these fucking gears like a clown. <laughs> Like a clown, like a fucking doofus, like an absolute moron. There we go. This game would be really immersive if you just like turned on a bunch of fucking like nature documentary monkey sounds like like apes just ripping each other to shreds and screaming. Yeah. At least I've gotten damn good at this. 
I've gotten damn good at this. Wait, 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 I'm panicking. Wait, 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 reset. 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 Reset it. Thank you. Thank you. Fucking hell. I'm back in the game, man. We're fine. Oh. I said, I'm back in the game and I'm fine. Thanks for understanding. I don't even remember what happened here that was so bad. Chewed up by the gears. can't really describe. Please, mother of God! God damn. All right, we're back in business. In. We are cooking. No, we're not. Just, just be cool. Just be cool and don't panic. The game wants you to panic. You need to be on the far side of this fucking thing so you actually have time to reach up and grab the next part or you fucking just fall instantly. You don't have enough time to do the full momentum to pull up. Grab it from the far right. Got it? Fuck! No, I didn't. We're okay. Damn, that part is brutal. It's just such a small window of time to actually pull up once you're actually there. It's microscopic. I'm, like, trying to see if I can grab it in the middle and have time. You just don't. You genuinely don't. You have to do it right. Dude, I don't care what this game says. My guy just fucking shattered his skull into a million pieces, dude. My dude... just fucking... absolutely died. Well, back up. I mean, I'm not... Here's the thing, at the very least, this part is a relatively forgiving for the first part. Because it does send me back to this pool. It could be... It could be exiling me to the pit. It doesn't. It could. So that's nice of him. Like, let's think with some positivity, you know? Okay, I, posit I'm done with positivity. I see nothing but fucking red, guys. I see red. The darkness within me is strong. And I'm planning on lashing out at me. Dude, I'm sorry. <laughs> Do you want to fucking grab it? Do you want to grab the fucking thing? Do you want to, do you want to, do you want to grab it?
Deck, my guy somehow managed to annihilate all the kinetic momentum he had by moving his hands. All of my kinetic force was put into my hands. He's tilting. No, I'm not tilting. I'm having a wonderful time, actually. Somehow, I'm actually quite enjoying this. Compared to getting over it style, I, I, the, the climbing it feels like I have enough control over that I'm not losing my mind. There it is. I wish this had narration as well. No, you fucking don't. Worst part of getting over it was whenever somebody came on the fucking microphone and was like, I want to talk to you about getting owned, you fucking loser. Like, it, except it was never, it was never so on the new, the, like, on the nose. It was always like, we should talk about loss now. I would have rather someone just got on the fucking mic and just went, yeah, yeah, that, I mean, I did, I cringed. I don't know about anyone else here, but I did. Like, get around all the bullshit. <laughs> Every once in a while, I haven't done the jump for long enough, or like, in such a long time, that I just don't do it anymore for a while. <gasps> oh, that was a clean one. That one was clean. That was clean as hell. My God, he's back. Dude, all right. I keep trying to grab with the wrong hand. And it's starting to, I'm starting to figure it out. I'm grabbing with the wrong hand on the top gear. I need to grab with this one. I don't know why I keep grabbing with the other one. There it is. No! Wait, that's okay, we're okay, we're okay. Fucking hell, dude. I don't know how to time that right. I have no idea how to time that right. That's rough. That part's the hardest part. Okay. Dude. Okay, well, it's fine. We recovered. I'm trying to see if I can actually stay on that gear long enough to properly, uh... Hang on, I'm gonna reset. I'm trying to see if I can stay on it long enough to just allow the weight to come down to the right spot, because it's clearly a really long timer on that weight. And if it's low, I can just casually climb onto it, but you can't see it while you're doing this part. Getting there, man. I'm getting there. Fuck. Oh. It's really hard. This part's rough. I'm trying not to rely too much on timing it perfectly because I've just no idea if I'll ever be consistent like that. I just don't know. Don't know. Why does he keep going down? Uh, because I have bad reflexes and my nerves are fucked. My nerves are fucking destroyed from years of hardcore competitive gaming. Gotcha. Is it? Got it. 
and I am safe on this. Got it! Got it! <sighs> he is out, which is actually bad because it means I'm in the danger zone where I can now fall to my fucking death properly. Guys. Try and see if I have a good grip on these fucking things. I don't trust it. I don't trust the window. Something's off about it. I'll take my chances with the fucking actual bushes. It wants me to take the fucking window. I think. Guys, it totally wanted me to take the window. Fuck. Yep. I need to go back over there. This was a scam. Easier to go down. One of these windows is gonna blow up and there's gonna be a monster that fucking grabs me! I already know it. Not stupid. Okay, it's gonna blow up and they're gonna be like, hee hee, this is what getting over it did, so we do it too! Hee 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 Oh, really? Okay, fuck. They're making me do a jump. Or a jump adjacent thing. Yep. Nope, you gotta. I'm gonna have to fling. You have to fling for this, I think. I don't think I can get it. You can't. Nope. Nope, maybe? No. No, no way. You have to do a very small fling. Okay, so that's what this bush is for, is so you don't get completely owned if you fuck up the fling. I get it now. I wasn't sure why it existed. That's a- that is a safety net. That's a net. Okay, that's fine then. I'll take a net. I can work with that. Easy. I can work with a net. Got it. We're going up. Guys. What if like... What if I'm about to win? Guys. Wait a minute, I'm not fucking going over there! There's no way I'm above a fucking pool if I go over there. Fuck that. I'm gonna- I'm gonna go for this spot. I'm not fucking going over there. That's how I die. Listen to this. Listen to that. It's the sound of a winner. Hey, listen to this. Sound of a winner. I'm not entirely sure where this game expects me to go here, so I'm gonna go this way. For now. Really? 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 Okay. Okay. No safety nets this time. Nothing but air. When he needs to game, he games better than anyone. Do you understand? Do not question the gamer. Do not make eye contact with the gamer. Oh, they're fucking... It's bad, guys. Oh, it's bad. Oh, it's bad. It's bad, guys. It's bad. We are over open air from here on out. Guys! Guys. Guys. Guys, we're over open air. I can't swing that far. Ooh. 
What the fuck is that? Dear God. Get it! Wait, wait, my guy's grip is insane on this thing. There's a chance. If I fuck this up, it's over, guys. There's like children watching from the fucking windows to the goddamn right, dude. Mom, look! There's a sicko! Everyone, get inside! Yeah. Hang on, I have to readjust. I can reach this without jumping. There's no fucking way I'm going to be fooled into jumping with this shit. Please. Oh, please grab the center. What is that? What the fuck is that? Is that a tie? I think I'm going to get more distance if I grab from the bottom. Than the sleeve. Dude, look at how little fucking surface area I'm hanging from right now. Ah! Oh my god! My body! My fucking body! <laughs> he lost grip on his own. Alright, so you can lose grip on that thing. I didn't release my hand. He just fell. Okay, now we know. Now we know. At least I didn't get exiled to the bottom. You know, I didn't get thrown to the bottom. I think I was too- I think I chose to have my grip on, like, the final pixel. And it cost me everything, guys. It cost me it all. Everything I had was lost in a fucking instant. So, uh... I'm just taking- sorry, I'm just taking, like, a minute. It's taking a minute to get my hands... Like, I'm not trying to get resituated. I can fucking do that, dude. At least I didn't die. Could have been worse. I could have. That could have been a thousand times worse. That could have been back to the bottom. And look at the speed of the climb now on this streamer. You can tell he's been training. You can tell there's a- Oh, fuck! Looks like he, uh, looks like he took a little bit of a tumble, but he's back on the climb again, folks. You can tell he's getting some confidence. All the failures have piled up. Oh my god, it looks like he almost got ripped in half right there, but he's still in the game. My god. Still not good at that part. Wish I was, but I'm not. Sometimes I just start choking. Sometimes, guys, it gets a little bad. Come on! Give me a fucking break! Please. Phase four. Delusion. It's not delusion. I really am the best gamer in the world. Check the internet. Stop. Stop. I need to do this right. Damn it! 
I have to do I have to do spacebar in two separate inputs or it doesn't work. Should probably just rely on the mouse exclusively for this part instead. Nope, that's even that's definitely gonna get me killed if I rely on the mouse now. Mima skipped 40 minutes. Guys, Mima stopped watching. She's gone. God damn! That part is easily... Even after doing the whole fucking clothesline part, that part's the hardest. That is easily the hardest part. Boom. Got it. And then my guy just gave up on grabbing. He just didn't feel like it anymore, guys. Okay. And reset. Yeah. Reset it. Huge. Gigantic throw right there. Gigantic throw. What's wrong with your fucking fingers? Grab, motherfucker, grab! Gotcha. I have to wait. I can hold right here safely. Got it. Got it. Fuck. Got it. We leave the cog zone again. The weirdo. Returns to the fucking township. Yeah. Ma, look! Look out the window! The dogs are back. The dogs are back. He's fucking back. Nastiest sound ever, this fucking sliding sound. This part sucks, eggs. That is if you suck at the game. <clears throat> Alright. Now I know I'm safe to swing as much as I like so long as I'm not on like the very bottom pixel. If you do that, the character loses his grip. So I'm safe like here. Come on. Got it. Need a little more. This sucks. I need more. You, your character like shakes around like crazy on this thing too. I need to grab the heft of it. That's not enough. Right there. Climb up it. <sighs> Center of mass on it. 
Don't go any lower or you get fucking killed. What the fuck? Okay, guys. On that part specifically, it just has less grip. Uh... Having done the dress and swung way harder, the guy just releases after you swing it more than two times on that one. You can't- you can't do like a full rotation. Okay, now I know. I thought it was because I was too low down. The t-shirt's just like, still wet, I guess. But now we know. Which means it should be a lot easier next time. At the very least, again, it's a safe fall. For now, I haven't landed in whatever part kills you in that area. Could be worse. I could be dead. I could be fucking dead. Ah! Ooh! Ooh! I don't know why I always forget how this part works. Even after being on it, I think the longest of any part now. Just at the fucking guy and move on, chat. All right, Jesus. Just fucking at the Adam and move on. How about you at the guy for like? How about how about someone makes a fucking character or like a username for at whenever tomato fucking pops off hard and does a jump perfectly on his first try? Because that's been happening a lot lately. How about that one? No, no, no. Only the goofy ones, man. Sorry, dude. Can't. Character limit. The only one we can fit is at, at me when tomato fails hard. Hee <laughs> hee. Whoopsie. At me when the boy get on, gets on. At me when the boy gets on. At me when he loses the game again. Please. The grace. No one's calling this guy Lanky Kong. Fuck. That part's still tricky. That's like a... That's a jump you have to go a little up with for the swing. Like it's a lot, all the other ones you've had to do so far are like relatively either straight or a little, actually not so much straight, but more so like down. Like, but this one, it's pretty much a perfect straight line you have to land. <laughs> God damn, I'm glad they give you this safety net, dude. This is one that I really need to practice, because, um... It's also the same fucking thing for that part on the roof that I've just gotten lucky on 15 times. The dome part, I've only been lucky at. Did you guys see that part where I embedded my toes into the fucking wall? The- my claws? The fucking talons right into the wall? I spent so much time panicking when that shit happens, I don't think about whether or not I could capitalize on that moment. Okay. I'm having an issue where I'm not positioning my mouse properly for this. I'm swinging too wildly and they're running out of space. I'm gonna take this one slower. I'm like using my whole mouse pad for the swing, and then when I try to actually do the swing, I- my hand falls off my fucking desk. Nope, that's bad. That's not it. Way too much swing. Going too hard. See? You don't need a lot. You just need a little. I'm like trying to do insane amounts of swinging, 
When you don't actually need that, and when you overdo it, it makes it worse. Not anymore. <sighs> okay, gamers. This part is actually not bad. And I say that in the sense of this whole thing is a, all a grabbable surface, so you can't fall very easily off the roof. So it's not as bad as I thought it was, actually. This is all really good, actually. I'm really happy with this area. Your sweat affixes you to the metal. Dude. Maybe. <laughs> Got it? Okay. I am not going to be fooled by that fucking t-shirt another time. Not this one. This one's okay. We love this one. Same with the next one. This one's also lovely. Same with the boxers. Whoa! The mouse gave out on me. Mouse gave out on me there. Center of mass. A little higher. Got it. This t-shirt is fucking lethal and I'm not gonna keep being tricked by it. So, uh... Get on it. And we're gonna do a quick swing to the fucking tie. It's a pool! You don't even need to get on the tie! It's a pool! We never needed to! Gamer God! Mom! Mom! The sicko's in the pool! Guys, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I'll be right back. guys look a slide I hope that doesn't dump us directly on the wrong side of the wall and fucking shoot us straight down to earth like an asteroid oh fuck you straight to hell dude what oh we're gonna have stuff just lying now oh we've reached the deception phase of the game oh oh okay We've reached deception. We're gonna be a little bit more silly with it now. <gasps> Dude, there's only one way up. I have to fucking jump to that part. Whoa. Ow! Fuck my leg! This part's fucked, guys. This, part's, this part might be evil. Am I sure I can't do this with just can-do attitude and gamer spirit? Am I fucking sure? You cannot. 
But I can do that with can-do attitude and gamer spirit. That green one isn't real! You're not real! Get the fuck out of here! I'm getting rid of all the green ones. You know what? I'm just not going to use them. Blue is real. The green jelly beans are bad. The green ones are bad. Ah! Woo! <gasps> that was fun. This is how the game should be. Have you guys started to notice that I've learned the tech? I've learned that I can angle my body in a specific way and then fucking fling myself with spacebar towards where my head is pointing. Wherever my head is pointing is where a spacebar pushes me. If it's aligned with my arm at the time. I'm figuring it out. I'm becoming more powerful. Again. I know that you keep on thinking that I can't get more powerful. But I'm here to tell you that's not actually true. I can't. See? See? Do you see that? Check this one out. Look at this. Look at the distance I'm obtaining from my climb. I feel like I should be allowed to reach this without all the bullshit. Wee! This is fun now! Guys, it's gone from being scary to being fun. Instead of a scary fall, it's just a fun slide. Oh, what a lovely day. After all the bullshit. You know? Got it. I'll grab that. Pull up. What? Oh, fun. Okay. Where, pray tell, am I taking this? You better not make me let go. Is it that tree? Ha! Like a trapeze artist. Got it. I guys, I get this weird feeling that I'm no longer supported by the, um... By that good, good slide. Does anyone have this? I have this weird feeling that the slide has left me. And it will not be catching me anymore. I have an even worse feeling. Is that, is that a balloon? Are we, are we entering some kind of clown part? Oh shit, it's pirates. Guys, every time I think it's bad, it gets worse. It's pirates now. And they put up a warning sign. Is this safe? This is climbable. Okay. Yeah. Okay, come on. Okay, I can keep myself perfectly balanced for a second. Whoa. What does that arrow say? Death? Does that arrow say death? Death down? Down is death. Yes. I want to get in the perfect center, so I'm not spinning too much if I do this. Impossible. I am not about to fucking swing on this. I'm not gonna do it. I'll fucking die. There's no way my guy holds it. I ain't doing it. Do it, loser. I won't. He'll lose the grip. Please. Please. Dude, it's totally possible without spinning. Though my guy's arms are about to get ripped off. If I do it right, it's totally doable. 
It is. Oh my god, chill out. This fucking thing. Huh. Oh, I almost had it that time. You have to be decisive and fast. Got it. Oh my god. The gamer rises again. He's entered the ball zone. A crow's nest. Oh, is, that, is this a power line? Dude, I'm going back towards the slide. I'm not taking any chances going the other way. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Now the question is, when do I get attacked? Like, what's that fucking sound? Is it the sound of the power line? Like, now we're back over the slide, kind of. So I feel a little bit. Why did it just creak? Hang on. Why is it creaking when I'm on this part? Stop creaking. Stop that. Bingo. I am going to- Mom, look! The sicko is on that fucking teetering steel beam above our house! No climbing the rope. No climbing the rope. Yeah? wonder if I can kind of seesaw it by using momentum. I'm trying to see if I need to chase it down or if I can seesaw it by going up, like, by, like, using my weight. I'm going to try that first. Death. It's not, like, bouncy. Okay, I do have to go fast. I got a lot of practice with this on the gears. This is literally impossible. There's not a single fucking chance in a million years I could possibly do this. There's no way. There's no way. Where the fuck did- what the fuck does this want me to do? What? The fuck? I have no clue how I would possibly do that. Huh. I mean like yeah chat, I can try to swing over, but I'm gonna I'm gonna weigh myself down. Like I'm not gonna be able to do it. Like, it, look at how long it- look at how fucking long this thing is. I'm going to try following the power line the other direction. Because this is insane. You would have to do a crazy amount of speed on this to do that. I'm gonna try going left. And confirm there's nothing over there. Just in case, dude, because that's psycho. I mean, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, right. None of these directions matter anymore. Guys, there's nothing right. Maybe this isn't the right way and it's a red herring? Dude, that's how I get killed. I messaged you, boss, okay? It's really weird and I wouldn't think to do this, but it's at 408 in this video if you want to see how to do it. 
I do. Okay. You jump up. You do what I did. Oh, that's psycho. Okay, I don't think I would have tried that. Okay, I actually don't think I ever would have tried that. That's psycho. Okay. All right, chat. So what apparently you have to do to even get this to work, the distance you are on either side, does it matter? It is just whether or not your arm is on one side of this thing or the other. So you kind of want to like do this and then swing to the other side and do this and like actually swing it back and forth. I don't... I don't know how the fuck you do that. That's crazy, dude. That's psycho. What? It's them in the pool. That's insane. That's insano mode. And the worst part is he's only four minutes into his speed run when that fucking happened. Oh, I did a fuck up. I fucked up. I did one part wrong, I'm thinking. Okay. I mean, I could get back up to that. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. I can I can do this. I can do this. Besides, we have this commercial swimming pool to hang out in. I can do this. This part's easy. This part's the easiest part of the night. This part this is the easiest part of the fucking night. Guys. Uh, this could be worse. We could be back in the gears. could be back in the gears, guys. Remember, things can always be worse. Ooh. That part sucks. That part, that part sucks eggs, though. I'm gonna be honest. That little jump sucks eggs. I don't care what you say. It sucks eggs. It's bad. It's beans. It's trash. At least we have a slide. Oh. Fucking hell. It's like one of those, it's like just like the water slide, uh, the waterfall. You have to be like really precise with it. God damn it, come on. Oh, I see. My arm is fucked. Hang on, let me. There we go. My elbow, my like wrist wasn't bending to the angle I needed to pull up right. Guess that does matter. Maybe I should be checking where my wrists are more often. Oh. Whoa! I don't know if it's better for me to just swing with one hand or two for that part. Not sure. I don't know. I feel like one hand is better. But then I don't get it ever. I always miss it. And the thing is, I can tell my hand is touching it because um, I hear the sound. You can't grab the rest of this. So I'm just, my guy's not grabbing it despite me having my hand over it. So, um... I think I need to, uh... I think I need to do a two-handed jump and then have two hands on it. I, I need to. Come on. Come on! Yeah. Nope. Not enough grab. 
Or my man's brains must be scrambled. It's- this is scrambling my fucking brains at a certain point, guys. At a certain point, it gets bad. I don't know what's going on anymore. Come on, man! Hardest part in the game. This is the hardest part in the game. Nothing else, man. Nothing else is real. Everything else is a fucking sick joke compared to this. It's all just a joke, but this part right here, this part's real. Wait, hang on. No, you- there's no way you can just- If I had any gamer accuracy, I would have it. If I just had gamer accuracy... At least the slide is epic. At least we have this fun fucking slide. Jesus. Hoop. What the? Okay, your guy can lose grip on the hoop. He can just lose it. We're learning things every day. What we once thought was safe is once again proven to be a sick lie. The t-shirt. Unsafe. The hoop. Unsafe. These things are not to be trusted ever again. Do not put your faith in them. They will betray you. Firmly grasp it. Firmly grasp it now. This part still sucks. Maybe I do it right in one go, though. You know? No, 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 nope. This part sucks, Eggs. This is the worst part in the fucking game. Let's play this is the worst fucking thing in the game. I'm gonna get a little higher up on this thing before I do this. Nope. Nope. God damn, man! God damn, man! Fuck. Hup! Hup! You can't stop me forever. Hup! Hup! You can't- you actually can't stop me forever. Eventually I'm getting up this thing. You can't stop me forever. You can try. Yeah. You know, I've been training to do this for years, you know. My fingers. Like big hot dogs. Yeah. Full of so much fucking muscle for climbing. The rest of my body, normal proportions. Just the fingers. Like all big and thick. Big hogs. Let me up. Let me the fuck up. I mean, like, the worst part is just pirate, whoever fucking parked their boat here is a fucking idiot because this wheel is on the outside. Who put this here? Like, real moron. Actual idiot. Boom, dude. Now for the balls. Now for the moment we've all been waiting for. The crow's nest climb.
followed by the power line. Followed by the most evil fucking part of the game since the last most evil fucking part of the game. Every day, people question my power. This thing's still rocking and shaking around from the last time we used it. Jesus. Time to build momentum. Don't get all turned around. The second you do, that's when shit gets bad. I feel like I'm not very good at this. Gotta be on it when it does this part. And on it when it does this part. And I go over here now. Fuck. That is how you do it. Problem is, it requires very qu a lot faster than what I'm doing to actually do it right. The problem is, this is insanely difficult to do because this whole thing isn't actually grabbable, to be clear. It's only the lines. To be clear. Big. Nope, missed it. All right, reset it. It's really hard. One more cycle. Dude, get on it. God damn, man. This is really fucking hard to do a horizontal climb with this guy. He's not built for horizontal. He's built for vertical climbing. He's... Not made for this. His whole body is rejecting this idea, guys. That was the best attempt yet. If I had stayed on it, I might have been able to do it right there. I literally, it went, it did another lap. And kept its momentum for some reason. Fuck. Commit. Stay here. Okay, that time it changed its mind. Sometimes it seems like it's not doing the same kind of momentum, which I might be able to work with. I might be able to do something about that. This part's evil. This part is evil, guys. Holy shit. Nope, if I had just fucking been able to get to the edge, I had it. Nope. If I had been at the edge, I had it that time. But I couldn't, I couldn't get to it in time. Fuck. Okay, reset. Reset. Pull back up here. Over the other side. One more. Yeah. 
Boom, dude! Boom! Let's get the fuck out of here. And where, pray tell, do I go now? Is that a pool? I have no choice but to assume it is, guys. I have actually no choice but to assume this is a pool. <gasps> Ooh -wee! Sheesh! He's still in the game. He's still in the game. Some people. By this point, break into a million fucking pieces. The bottom of the lake. But me? Why is this so fucking slippery? Wait, why is this wood so slippery? I would appreciate just a normal climb for a bit. You know, like a normal climb. Maybe like a normal one. Oh, yes. It could never be so simple, could it? Yeah? Might as well blow my brains out now. <laughs> oh! Head shattered, annihilated, destroyed in a fucking instant by the impact. Dude, my melon absolutely cracked. I'm dead, man. I'm dead. This is the most rigid rope I've ever swung on. You know, I have to get some more distance or height first. Not sure why the rope is doing what it's doing, but sometimes that works. Oh! This sucks. This one's rough. This is this is like a it's like going against my understanding of physics, guys. This is like some sick game physics that doesn't make any sense. Look at this. What the fuck is this thing? It's like alive. Thank God I, this hasn't killed me yet and sent me back to the fucking depths, guys. Jesus. I have an idea. Some of you may think it's psycho when I do it, though. We are gonna do it very fast this time. While it's still holding its momentum. Nah, it lost it immediately when I grabbed it there, Jesus. Got it! Jesus fucking Christ! You get up higher. Oh! Green is the betrayer! Green is the betrayer! You think I'm stupid? Red is friend. Okay, this is gonna suck eggs. Lean down! Realistically lean down reliably for me, please. Please! Thank you. Fucking hell. Evil. Evil plank. Evil plank. What is this shit? 
<laughs> gamer. Gamer. Guys, yeah, gamer. He games. Easiest section in the fucking game, dude. What the fuck? All right, next zone. He makes it look so easy. What can I say? A beautiful spring. A beautiful fucking spring. Wait, where the fuck do I go? <laughs> Wait, where the fuck do I go? Huh? Did I like pass the fucking zone I'm supposed to climb from? I like, I, I like actually like, oh, I see. I didn't see that it wants me to do an impossible jump. Yeah, yeah. It wants me to do an impossible jump, guys. That's fine, I can do that. It wants me to do an impossible vertical jump. While it's slippery. While it's slippery. It just wants me to do this casually. Dude. My guy can't get a grip on this fucking stone. Look at this. Look at this. Look at the grip. <laughs> I will have to cut my legs off to go any higher. This may be my filter, guys. I would I would have to cut my legs off. It is simply not realistic. There cannot. How the fuck? How in the hell does a man do this shit? When this fucking stone has collision on top of it, so I can't even like get higher. Am I slipping like crazy? Ain't no way. I must have missed something, guys. That's the only chance that there is. I must have missed a rock. No. No. No, 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 no! All right. Guess I just have to do it perfect. Actually fully impossible. Guys, is the thing. There's just, I have to learn the one-handed jump because the two-handed does too much leg swinging. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. This- I will never have that much vertical. I will- this is my filter. This is- this is the moment that ends my climbing career. Objectively still more skilled than many a gamer, but yet not the most skilled. Nope. There's no way. 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 He doesn't know about the double jump mechanic. I have an idea. I have an idea, guys. I just need to be a little bit more sensitive. For just this one.
That's not it. <laughs> There's like this thing where sometimes it almost looks like my, I can almost reach it, but I know that's bullshit. I don't think you can just throw yourself properly. I think you have to like, I think you have to do the propel yourself. Guys, I think you might have to do what I just tried. You angle yourself with a swing and then use spacebar to actually fling yourself for it. I think that's the best chance I have. I think I do a double-handed spacebar fling. It's just so slippery. That was the closest I got. That was the closest I got. Right there. That one, not so much. Easy. No, dude, no. Dude, no. Bro, no. Bro. No. No, 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 guys. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Guys, I think I may just adopt a lifestyle of being like a mountaintop troll. And when people try to get onto this part of the beach, like the water, I'll like punch them really hard back down the cliff and maybe that'll be what I do from now on. Because, um, that's, uh, that's it. I, uh... I think this might be the end of my climbing adventure. I think I could have almost had it right there. But even if I did have it, look at the next one! Look at the next jump! Imagine a multiplayer game of this. There's Pogo stuck. There is Pogo stuck. That does exist. Yeah, if it wasn't if it wasn't slippery. If only it wasn't slippery. I tomato gaming. Give this three more tries. Before. I give up before I accept myself as a lowly gamelet. There are two more tries remaining. There is one more try remaining. Shut. If I touch the water. My character burst, bursts into ashes and the stream ends. So just in case, I will be back tomorrow at the usual time. So just in case that happens, I will see you all tomorrow at the, norm at the normal time. But if I succeed, then I'll see you in exactly five seconds, okay? I'll see you in exactly five seconds when I land this one. When I land this one, and that is it. Last try. Let's fucking go. Oh. I guess I can't actually make it like acid and make my guy burst into ashes. Sorry, guys. I had to like reach over and find the stop streaming button, and I realized there was behind a like a fucking internet browser. So, um. I I'm just gonna go. <laughs>